This lesson deals with supplemental problem 8.4. You can find this problem in the course ebook in the chapter 8 supplemental problems on page 5. In this supplemental problem, I'm going to make what I call a low budget karaoke machine using the circuits of supplemental problem 8.1 and 8.3. So shown here is a circuit that looks very much like what we had in supplemental problem 8.1 where we're summing three inputs. Music from a left channel, music from a right channel, and then sound from this other circuit that's hooked up here. We're going to use a power op amp like we discussed in supplemental problem 8.2 to drive a speaker. Let's see if we can solve for the speaker voltage in terms of these inputs and this one and the value of this pot. All right, from supplemental problem 8.1, the voltage at the output is going to be equal to minus 10k over 1k times this input, which will be the left channel of some music source, and then minus the ratio of 10k to 1k times this input, which is the music from the right channel, and then minus 10k divided by this total resistance I'm going to call R sub x, which can vary from 1k to 11k. So when I move the pot all the way to this end, short out the pot, and just get 1k, put it all the way to the other end, I get 10k plus 1k. Now what's the voltage here? Well this is our differential amplifier from supplemental problem 8.3. The voltage here is equal to the ratio of this resistor to this resistor, provided that the ratio of these two is the same as the ratio of these two. So this voltage then is going to be equal to 33k divided by 600 times the voltage V2 minus V1. Now when there's a voltage labeled at one node, looks like it's flying in the air. What's implied is that this is the plus terminal and this is the minus terminal where there's ground. And likewise here, the plus terminal and then the minus terminal. So this is our V1 and this is our V2. So the rise in voltage is V2, the drop is V microphone and then plus V1. So we can then solve for the microphone voltage as V2 minus V1. And of course that's that term right here. You can substitute that difference for the microphone voltage. Now what's going on here is we're taking two sources of sound and we're amplifying them and adding them together and then changing their sign. As long as everything has a sign change, it's just going to be an overall phase shift for all the music and sound that comes in. You really wouldn't notice that. This is really creating a monaural system from a stereo system. And then the microphone allows you then to sing over the music that you're picking up. And you can make this louder or softer if you want to overpower what's here or not. Also, we've got some long wires with the microphone which is not uncommon. Typically we pick up noise from a variety of wireless sources, radio stations, cell phones, but the voltage across these two terminals is the difference of the two. So if there's a common noise on this wire and a common noise on this wire, when you subtract, they disappear. This is how you make a simple karaoke machine, and this is Submetal Problem 8.4.